Hello Year 9 parents and Year 9s. For those who don't know me, my name is Mr Tomlinson and I'm the Head of Business Studies. I'm very excited to be uh, talking to you about the BTEC Award in Enterprise, a brand new scheme of work for 2022, just right for you to start your GCSEs and your future career as a young entrepreneur. Before I go into each, into each component's detail, I want to give you an assessment overview. So we've got three components. Component one, exploring enterprises. Component two, planning and presenting a micro enterprise idea. Both of these have guided learning hours of 36. Qualification weighting is 30%. Marks available 60. Internally assessed, externally moderated by the exam board. Length of assessment, six hours month of preparation for component one and five hours of supervised sessions. The same for component two, however, you have seven hours of supervised sessions. Component three, marketing and finance and enterprise, taking what we've learned from component one and component two and how the marketing and finance can move forward within a company. This is a two hour exam which is done in the exam series in January, February or May in due time from 2024. So you might be thinking why choose a BTEC in the first place? Well, for me, it's a great way to have a hands on experience alongside your GCSEs. Of course, the BTECs come from Pearson's, the world leading learning company. Their mission is um, to provide high quality content and learning experiences as well as assessments and qualifications that help people build on your skills that you already have. So component one, we'll look at different types of companies. These are local companies, Ilkeston and around there. You may have even visited some of these along your way. So it's understanding the skills needed by these entrepreneurs, these people that run a local businesses and explore how they find their research and how they do the re how they manipulate the research and look at it the data to make future products to be able to appeal to the local uh, customers such as yourself component two is planning and presenting a micro enterprise idea so this is you looking at two realistic ideas for a micro enterprise hoping that one of these uh, micro enterprises you'll be able to actually take to market, be able to make the product and sell. We use this as part of Young Enterprise and this is uh, for you to be able to have a platform to run a company and get help and support from local business advisors, as well as looking at business plans and how to review your product for it to be able to make money in the future. Component three, as I said, this is a uh, exam done in the January, February or May, June exam series. And this is looking at how enterprises identify their target market, looking at the financial documentation and how this marketing and finance is uh, put across to the public and what decisions you might make and strategies to move the company forward. I've put a link there so you can see an example of the exam so you know what it looks like prior to taking your options. So choosing the BTEC award. So these are all the way from level one to level two. So they have the same rigor as GCSEs, but they are um, available, as I said earlier, component one and component two in the form of an assignment where you would type up the work that you've learned. Many progression routes into post 16 and looking at different co uh, current sectors and behaviours and knowledge of different companies will help you create your own company moving forward. So embedding learning throughout, we explore in business, so researching, underpinning the basic knowledge of what is required for each of our local companies and your own, and then develop that knowledge and skills and implement the tools and techniques and giving you the equipment to be able to look at your own macro enterprise in component two and taking it to market. Once you've taken it to market, applying your learning to the real life context of how this would come about in your GCSE and being able to reflect on this is a really big part of you understanding what a business is and how it will run not only uh, experiencing the pitfalls that you may come across, but also how you overcome these. 
Now, this leads on to many uh, post-16 options. So you might take the BTEC in business or A-level in business, or you may run a business alongside your future options. But it leads to many, many fields, public services, hotel, retail, banking, marketing, management, sales, nearly every um, business along the way um, within um, any retail or hotel and restaurants or any type of job will have some type of business underpinning them. Well, it was fantastic to speak to you. If you've got any questions, uh, my email is on the school website. Also, you could call the school and I'll give you a ring back. But at this point, I really look forward to you picking your options. I look forward to answering any of your questions. I teach many of you in ICT. So in year nine, so if you have any questions uh, following this presentation, please don't hesitate to ask at the end of the lesson. And um, I look forward. Thank you.